Okay, so before getting started, I just wanted to mention that to me, the final product was a fail. Um, I like some things about it, but other things could have been done better, but because it was last minute, I just didn't have the time to do it in time for Halloween. So you guys decide if you want to follow all the steps I did to make my costume. So when I was thinking about how I was going to make this costume, I was really struggling. So where I went to every single TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross, Burlington, every single store, and I could not find any pieces for this costume until I realized that I have it in my closet already. So let me show you the pieces I already have and then we're gonna work from there to get the other stuff. As you can see in this picture of Strawberry Shortcake, she has like puffy sleeves, right? I've been had this in my closet for years. Now the next thing was super tricky. I was looking for a pink skirt at every single store. But then I realized I have a pink dress that I bought earlier this summer. So it's a dress and as you can see back in the picture, the skirt part, kind of like it's almost attached to the top. So I'm gonna wear this under and then the white shirt on top. What sucks though is that this pink dress already has a pattern on it. So I'm really looking for like either strawberry stickers or like dot stickers to cover it up. I got the stuff guys and it wasn't that expensive. One dollar for the wig cap, six dollars for the hair. It should be hot pink but red is close enough so yeah. Um, I was worried because I thought a wig was going to be like twenty dollars and up but Walmart came through. All right guys, um, so I got all of my Amazon stuff, but I waited till last minute to put it together and I have to go to this party in a couple hours. So let me show y'all what I got. I got the socks already. I got these felt stickers that I'm gonna add onto the dress. And then I got the hat. I also got some felt. I haven't opened it yet, but the felt is in here. So yeah, hopefully this all works out. So let's get started. So let's start off with this circle stickers. I'm just gonna put them on the dress. Okay, I got a few left, but I don't think I'm gonna use them all. This is what it looks like now. Polka dots on the front, polka dots on the back. Okay guys, next thing we're gonna work on is the hat. Okay, it's pretty big. This part, the shady part, it's green and then it has like the strawberry green leaf right here. And then it has the little seeds that are a darker shade of like pink. And sorry for the vacuum noise, my dad is working outside in the yard. I have the green and it's sticky. Okay, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I kind of got an outline going here. Okay, so that's part one, and then I'm gonna add the little triangles here. This little one and it's gonna be the green thing like on top of the, the hat right here where the little circle is okay so it's gonna go right here okay i don't know how i feel about this one but i'm gonna just go ahead and do like the seeds and i'll worry about this one later i could just use these oh my gosh good thing i did not use up all of them since it's already circular, I'm just gonna like cut straight around the circle and it should give you like that kind of seedish shape. I, I cut the first seed. This is uh, what the hat looks like. It looks all right, it's not that great. It's cute, it's cute. But yeah, it, it looks a little rough. Still wondering what I should do with the little leaf at the top. I will work that out once I do something with my shoes. Um, remember, I'm gonna use these Toms. And her shoes are like, to me, I don't know what they're called, but they remind me of like schoolgirl clothes. I mean, schoolgirl shoes. They look like flats, but then they have the strap in the middle. So I'm gonna make it look like it has a strap by using this white felt and cutting like um, a semicircle kind of and putting it right here. So it kind of looks like it's like the sock peeking through. Still trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with this hat. But for right now, I'm gonna take a break. 
so the break I took was a teensy bit too long and I had to rush that last part of the hat off camera because I was late. So let me just explain to you what I did. So I made the same shape as before, but this time instead of three leaves, it was four and it was a lot longer. In order to have the leaves standing up, you need to trace the shape you just made again and then place that on the sticky side of your first shape. Also, make sure that instead of covering all of the sticky side, that you stick the bottom part of it to the actual hat itself. Overall, I'm gonna rate this DIY costume a 6 out of 10 just because there was a lot of things I don't like about it. 